Hello, this is Dr. Srinivas Murthy TM. I am an ENT consultant practicing at Ashwanpur. I consult at Columbia Asia Referral Hospital Ashwanpur as well as my clinic which is Srinivas Speciality ENT Center uh, which is located in Ashwanpur. So allergies. Now uh, allergy is basically a phenomenon uh, wherein a particular um, human uh, tends to uh, react abnormally um, to a known stimulus or a, to a stimulus which is present to which another human being will probably not react. Uh, so this overreaction by that um, body or a human or that organ is called allergy. Now commonly in the ENT what we see is the allergic rhinitis that means the nose tends to react abnormally uh, to something that the nose breathes. That is something is uh, prevalent in the air and your nose starts uh, behaving abnormally and the resulting symptoms would be uh, sneezing, itching, running nose uh, which will be watery and um, congestion that means your nose gets blocked after some time. Now these are two types. One is called perineal allergic rhinitis that is uh, the people who suffer from perineal allergies uh, they tend to have symptoms throughout the year. Perineal is um, all through the year. And then uh, there are some uh, allergies which are called seasonal allergies. Now in seasonal uh, people who are allergic to seasonal allergies, that particular allergen is found in the air only in du during those seasons. Now typically during spring what happens, um, there is a pollen, um, a pollen uh, which is uh, uh, released by the plants. Um, flowers are springing uh, everywhere, um, uh, new leaves come out. So a lot of um, uh, plants tend to release uh, their pollens and other um, allergens into the air and people who are prone to get stimulated by them will start showing symptoms. That's why we see a spurt of um, patients uh, during spring uh, 